Welcome to another TE Changeover. My name is Chris, and I'm here with Sam to talk about the head MXG1. Sam, I know you've described this racket as the MXG player's frame. Can you elaborate on that? And then also tell us you know, how it differs from the other rackets in the line. Absolutely. So the MXG series started out with thicker beams, very lightweight. Um, they offered great speed through the air, but tons and tons of power. With the MXG1, they thinned out the beam quite a bit, shrunk the head size to 98, and they made it for players who were swinging the racket a little bit faster. Okay, and can you tell me about the magnesium bridge? So the magnesium bridge is the big feature of the MXG frames, and it basically allows for greater stability even with the light weight. It also makes the main strings longer, so the ball stays there, the ball stays on the racket face longer for more power. Okay, and I know you play tested it for a little while. Do you have any insight for people that might want to switch to this? I think when I first picked up the MXG, it felt very light, and I wasn't sure how stable it was going to be, but I was very impressed taking full swings at the ball, and my shots were still coming down inside the baseline. Thank you, Sam, and thank you for tuning in to another TE Changeover. For more, subscribe to our YouTube channel below, and don't forget that you can demo the MXG1 yourself at TennisExpress.com. We'll see you there.